for today's video we're gonna try out some new makeup products which is gonna be fun and there's Disney and I'm so excited so if you guys are new make sure you subscribe down below let's get the video started okay. so to begin I purchased this products um just to make it clear, I am not a beauty guru. Look, look, my skin is not clear. As you can tell, I have a whole bunch of pimples right here. I'm working on it. I'm, clean, I'm trying. I'm doing this remedy that I have to do before uh, special events in May. So I need it. Mine. I need. I need clear skin, honestly. So, so don't mind the pimples. Again, I'm not a beauty guru. My skin is not perfect. You can tell. Look at that. It's just bad acne right now. Bad acne. So, uh, the products that we're going to be using is a collection that I'm really hyped for. I was I fir The first Disney collection, Disney makeup collection that this brand did was the Disney Princess. Yeah, I like my princesses, but... I love my villains more because they're underrated and they deserve the hype too. Not just the princesses, they deserve that hype. Right now I'm wearing my Villains Academy. So pumped. Um, we're gonna be using the new ColourPop Disney Villain Collection. So I got the Misunderstood palette. This is how the design looks. You can see all the Disney villains right here. You have like Maleficent, you have Cruella. Um, who else do you have? You have Ursula right here, right here, right here, and you also have, where's Hades? Oh, Evil Queen. Evil Queen is like right here in the corner. I didn't see that. She's right there. And then when you turn the palette to the back, it has all the names of the colors, which, ooh, so excited, so excited. So yeah, I really like the packaging on this palette. Really, really pretty. Um, we also got the lipsticks. We have the Evil Queen one. I designed like the package, like it looks like a neon sign of the of the it, freaking villains. Like that is freaking cool. Like oh, I love, I love the packaging. So we got the Evil Queen, which how it looks right here, and Cruella, which is right here. Oh. Super freaking pump. Now inside is how the colors look. Yeah, I see it. I see you. That is so pretty. Wow. Look at that. And then the box design. Super pretty and super dark. Love. Love. Look, see that. And then in the back, it also tells you about the colors. And the white one is no spots. Next to it is Mongrels, which is that shimmer right here. Diablo, which is this one. Uh, Devious, which is this one. And Tragic, which is this one. Right here. That one looks like a more nude color. So we got a lot of shimmers. There's some mattes in there. But yeah, really, really pretty. Super. Look at that rainbow holograph. Dang, so pretty. So that's the palette, misunderstood palette. And next, we have the lipsticks. I want to open up Evil Queen. Ooh, <laughs> look at this tube. <gasps> wow, so it's a black tube and it has the designs of the vi Disney villains. So we got. Oh, shoot, I did not know that. We got the Hades, the, the three six headed monster. Or is it more than that? I don't remember. We have crossbow, which I I wish they included hook. I wish they included hook in the packaging or anything in the collection. We got the evil queen apple right here, poison apple right there. We have Maleficent's crow right there. I don't know if you guys can see that. There you go, right there. And there's spots. At, oh dog prints all over it too for Cruella. Here. There you go. You see the dog prints? Super pretty. Oof. Wow. So yeah, that's a pack. Oh, wait, I forgot Ursula. Ursula. We have her shell right here. 
There you go. Super pretty. And then in the top. Oh, actually. Is it this way? Okay, okay, okay. So in the bottom. In the bottom, it has a color. And it says villains, evil queen. So evil queen is like more like a. I, I thought it was a burgundy color, but I guess not. And this is how it looks in the tube. Oh, look at that. On this side, it says villains. It's so pretty. Look at that shine. Oh my gosh, so freaking pretty. Oh, that's uh, beautiful. That is beautiful. Next, we got Cruella. Open her up. Cruella is more like a red red because we all know Cruella is famous for her red lipstick. Same packaging, black tube, super pretty. And the bottom says Cruella. Yeah, so let's see how this baby looks. <gasps> yeah, put it all the way for you. Look at that. <laughs> so it's like a normal red, red, red lip. Super pretty. And ColourPop lipsticks are really cheap. They're like $8. So, and they do last pretty well. So highly recommend. Like, look how pretty that is. <gasps> that is so pretty. Oh. So yeah. We're gonna do looks with these products. And I can't wait. Okay, for any makeup, we're gonna start with primer. So primer, I've been using Neutrogena Prep Correct Primer with Redness Correcting. This is how it looks. Again, my skin is not perfect, so I gotta cover up my pimples. So I'm just gonna dab that all over my face. Awesome. Awesome, okay. Face is prime. Now we're gonna. I always like to change it up a bit, so I'm gonna do my brows. I suck at brows, honestly. I suck at brows, so I'll be using the Goof Proof Brow Pencil from Benefit. Easy handy. I'm just gonna fill in whatever I have, cause I, again, I suck at doing brows. So we're just gonna, just gonna fill them up. I really suck at doing brows. Whatever. So, I tried, okay? I really do. I, again, I suck at them. Um, so, for that, after that, I'm just going to set them with a gel. This is the... Uh, Bri Briva... What the heck? Um, but it's this brand. Uh, and the color is Frida. I really like the packaging. So we're just gonna make them a bit darker. Make them a bit darker. Oh my gosh. Well then. Whatever. I hate brows. I'm sorry. I hate, I hate brows. I hate brows. I hate brows. Honestly, I hate brows. Okay. Well, that is set. Um, now I'm just gonna put some concealer just to cover a bit more of my pimples because, yeah, they're really red. Just gonna, I've been using the Tarte Creaseless Concealer. Cool. I already dabbed my brush, uh, brush my sponge. I'm just gonna, cool, cool. Pimples semi covered, and my butt's gonna be asleep. Okay. Now, we're gonna do the freaking eyeshadow palette. Ooh, I'm so excited. Okay, so I don't have an eyeshadow primer, so I've been using the Maybelline uh, concealer as my eyeshadow brace. So I'm just gonna put that all over. All over my eyes. Do that really quickly. Okay. So what we're gonna do now, we're gonna do the palette. So I'm gonna do some swatches so that way you guys can see how pigmented these colors are and if they're worth your money. So we're gonna start with spots. No spots. No spots. AKA Oz Oh Oddball. She had no spots. I see you, color pop. I see you. So we're gonna put it on this arm. Which I'm gonna get rid of this. And I'm gonna use this hand. So I'm gonna get no spots. So far, it does look really white. 
Okay, okay. Now, put on my arm, see if it's pigmented or not. Hmm, can you see it? I guess I should get more. And just stab it. Can I see it? I honestly can't see it. I, mean, I feel like it's why it's pretty hard to get like a good pigmented on it. That's how white it is. I don't know if you see it. So now we're gonna do mongrels with that gold shimmer right there. Let's so we'll do that. Oh, this one's really pigmented. Like, look at that. There you go. See? So this is no spots. This one's mongrels. Let's see how it looks on my arm. <gasps> oh, that one's pretty. Okay, okay, okay. Let's do one more. <gasps> wow. Do you guys see that? I don't know, but that's mongrels right there. It's like a pink shimmer. But it looks gold. Wait, 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 wait. Am I blind? Oh, that is pretty. That is really pretty. Okay. Okay. I don't know if you see that. That is, that is pretty. Wow. Okay. Next one is Diablo, which is that yellow shimmer right there. I'm going to do that one right now. <sighs> what the heck? There you go. So that one was Mongrels. This one is Diablo, which is like a yellow shimmer or yellow green shimmer. But let's see. How it goes. Oh yeah, it's like a lime green. That is a lime green. <gasps> wow. That is it. I don't my lime's so bad, but dang, you can see that one pretty good. It's like a green. I thought it was yellow. Right here looks yellow. But that is green. That's cool. Okay. Next is devious, which is like a matte orangey color. I'm gonna swipe that. Oh yeah, it's a mat. For sure it's a mat. That is cool. Let's see how it looks. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, you can see that. Okay, okay, okay. We got something to work with. Nice, color pop. And the next one is tragic, which is like a nude color that I told you guys about. That one. What? I'm gonna use my thumb because I don't have any more. Yeah, it's like a matte. I think it's like a nude. Yeah, that's totally nude. You guys can't see that at all, but that that, that nude. Ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. that is pretty. Okay, so the ones that had the most pigmented out of the top row is definitely Diablo. Look at that. Oof, compare. This one was mongrels, it's no spots. This one was devious, and this one was tragic. You guys can see that? Dang. Now for the second row, which is all these shimmers in that blue. That blue is calling my name. So we got Underworld, which is like a gold. It looks like a rose gold. No, it's like a, yeah, a rose gold. This one. So let's see how it's going to look. Oh, I was wrong. It's an orange color, like a copper color. That is nice. So we can do a swatch. <gasps> wow. Who would have thought? <gasps> you see that? Oh, okay, that one's pretty. That one's really pretty. So that one is Underworld. Next is Pain and Panic, which is the one next to it. It's like the gold, 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 gold one. So let's see. Mm, that one doesn't feel creamy. Yep. Gold. Okay. Yep. That one has a yellow tint to it. Compared to the Underworld, which is like an orange. That's nice. That is nice. Next we have Forest. Forest of Thorns. Look at that purple one. Alright, let's see purple. Ooh, they're soft. Oh, wow. Ooh, that purple. That purple. You see that? Oh, dang, that purple is nice. Ooh, let me do one more swatch because that is pretty. That 
purple. Dang. Okay. I see you. The next one is Flotsam, which is that. Another shimmer. And that one looks like a pink. Hmm. Let's see. Yep, it's like a pink shimmer. Really pretty. Yeah, it's a it's a pink shimmer. I don't know if you see that, but that that's how it is. Flotsam. There you go. Yeah, pink shimmer. Now the blue. Oh my god. Okay, the blue. It's called the Fates. I don't know why. It makes no sense. Okay, there he goes. Ooh, it's a matte. Do you see that? Ooh. Wow. Ooh. Dang. Dang. Dang, that blue is pretty. Okay, color pop. Okay. Yes, I know you see that, but that that blue. Dang. Okay, so the order. Um Underworld. Underworld. This one was Pain and Panic. The purple one was Flower of Thorns. This pink Shimmer is Flotsam, and blue is the Fates. I'm shook with that blue. That is nice. That is nice. Okay, the last row is more of a darker side. More of a darker side. So we got Revenge, which is this one. This black shimmer. We have Sing, which is like another brown shimmer. We have Jet Sun, which is like a navy shimmer, like blue green. Oh no, it's like a dark, dark blue. We have Facil, which is a green shimmer. And last but not least, we have a matte black 101. So let's go by order. So we're gonna do Revenge. Revenge, Revenge, Revenge is gonna be mine. All right, let's see. Revenge, don't let me down. Ooh, ooh, oh, that is nice. Okay, Revenge. So it's like a gray shimmer. Okay, okay. It does, I see like a little bit purple in there. Or am I blind? I don't know, but that is nice. Next, we have Sing, which is like a Brownish color? Mmm. It's like a burgundy red purple. This see, okay, so this is this black one is revenge. This one is sing. So we're gonna swatch that. Yeah. Dang. <laughs> color pop is stepping up. Look at the colors. Wow. Okay. Okay, I see, I see you. Wait, this one has like a more purple burgundy shimmer. If I'm saying them correctly, I told you I'm not a beauty guru. Next, we have Jetsum, which is like a blue green shimmer. Mm hmm. It looks like a galaxy color. Look at that. Ooh, so this is Jetsum. Let's watch it. Oh, I was wrong. I was so wrong. It has like a purple tint to it. I was wrong. Wow. Okay. Okay. So Jetsum, I thought it was going to be more blue-green. But it turns out it's more blue-purple. Which I still don't mind. That's so pretty. Alright. Next we have Facil. Which I'm trying to figure out what feeling are you. So we're just going to swatchy swatch. Oh, this one's cool. This one is more like a seaweed green. You guys see that? Oh, that is pretty. So again, this one is revenge. If I, yeah, revenge. This one is sing, jetsam, and this one's facile. And I just shook my camera. Sorry. So let's watch that. Oh, that is pretty. 
Okay, color pop. Wow. I don't know if you have to see the color. I again it's shot. Dang. Ooh. Ooh, we didn't even notice watch. That is pretty. <laughs> I'm digging these colors. These are so cool. Okay. Okay. And last but not least, we have 101, which is a matte black. I'm gonna use my thumb because I don't have any more fingers. What I gotta say, that is a matte black. Yep, matte black, alright. That's an ugly swatch, but that's that's one on one, that black one. Again, one more time. This one is Revenge, Sing, Jetsam, Basil, and the black is 101. So those are all the colors on the palette. I really like um which ones did I like? That blue one, the fates. Oof. That one was nice. There's a lot of nice colors, I gotta admit. The white one though, I feel like it needs more pigment. But again, I feel like it's gonna be really hard to get the exact white, white color you need. So now, we're gonna swatch the lipsticks. Okay, so we're gonna swatch the lipsticks now. I only got two. It was Evil Queen and Cruella. Evil Queen had a more burgundy color. I'm gonna swipe that up really quickly. I'm just gonna. Oh, I was wrong. I was wrong. But that is so creamy. And ooh, okay, evil queen. I see you. Okay, so this is more like a red apple, a red apple um color. I thought it was to be burgundy. It is really creamy, really soft. Good job, ColourPop. That. So this is Evil Queen. Cruella. Hello. Cruella is more like a red, red. Like a red, red lip. So let's see how that looks. Super pretty. Oh, I see the difference. Okay, you see the difference? I see the difference. Yep. So again, Cruella is just a basic red lip. Uh, compared to Evil Queen, which is more like an apple red. Okay, <laughs> not bad, not bad. Really soft. I really like the the formula they use for the lipsticks. Like it's really creamy, and I, and it's a matte. It's not sh it's not shiny at all. It's really really matte. Will it last the whole day? I don't know, but we're gonna test it out. Ooh, I'm digging this collection so far. So now we get to do it like all together. So I'm gonna do. We'll do one look today. Let's change the lip. I'm prepared. I'm prepared. Honestly, I don't know what. What? I guess. What colors to do for this eye look that I have planned? For sure, I want to use the lipsticks. For sure. So we're just going to go as I go. And we're going to start off with base color. So the base color that I'm going to use is Tragic. My brushes aren't clean. I need to wash them. That's why I probably have these pimples because I haven't washed my brushes. So we're going to use Trizic. I'm going to use this eyeshadow brush from e.l.f. Ooh, you guys saw that? I'm just going to swirl it and then <laughs> pat that up, pat that up, and just go in. Ooh, okay. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. We shall see, we shall see. Honestly, it's not bad. Really pretty. Um, but it feels like it blends in with my eye really well. Okay. Okay. You guys can see the color. <laughs> I don't know. See that other eye. Yeah, if you guys want like a neutral or like a natural look with this palette, this is a color for you. Honestly, me. Honestly, me. Okay, so the next color, I think I am just going to do like a natural look with this. Maybe one shimmer. Who knows? Um, The next color I'm going to put in my crease is 
devious which is this one the orange matte one that i showed you guys which is was really pigmented honestly so we're gonna do that give it a little swirl do that and just put it all over the crease okay all right i see okay that is done what to do? What to do? What's the next color? I mean, honestly, you could just do it like that and then put like a shimmer on top in the eyelid in the center. But we're gonna be adventurous, huh? We're gonna do like a bit of a smoky eye. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get some of that black. That black color is calling my name. So, we're gonna be using 101 to create like a little smoky eye effect. I'm gonna pat that in. Oh, it's really, really pigmented. Just gonna put it in the corner. Because we do want to get like a little bit of like the darker side. Okay, you see that? Okay. Okay. Blending a brush and blend that out. Where's, where's my mirror? I don't think I see crap. We're gonna blend that out. Blend, 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 blend. So now I'm just gonna clean up. Clean up before I add stuff to it. I'm just gonna go like that. Create a nice cut. And the good thing is that I haven't done my foundation. See? Perfect cuts. Perfect cuts. Cool. Okay. Next, we're gonna use a shimmer. But I kind of want to see how pigmented that white is. So I'm going to put that in the corner of my eye. And see how that looks. So I'm just going to do that. A bit powdery. You see that? Cool. No spots. I don't want spots. Oh, there's no spots, huh? Okay, there's one no spots. <laughs> the white will be like a base. And then we'll put a shimmer on top. That sounds good. I'm going to put that in the corner. In the corner a little bit more a little bit, do, 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 do. A little bit more okay so now we'll put a shimmer and I think I'm gonna use hmm I think for the corner to make it more pop I'm gonna use mongrels which is the one next to it so I'm just gonna clean that off really quickly and put that in the that is, ooh, that is pretty. There's my mini mirror. Like, where's my mini mirror? I'm just put that on top. We dig. We dig. Next, I'm going to use my finger. And we need a color in the middle. So, to make more of a dramatic look, we're going to use purple. It's calling my name. So, maybe, okay, you know what? Yeah, we're going to do purple. So we're going to do the forest of thorns, which is that purple one right there pretty and it's gonna put it all over my eye so in order to get that purple to pop you need to build up you gotta build them up dig in it dig it dig it dig dig it what the heck did this girl do to her eye? <laughs> that purple. That purple. I'm so shook with it. That is so pretty. I was not expecting that. <laughs> Look how head. I'm just building up. Okay. So, I'm going to take this off. That purple. That is pretty. It looks like an Ursula color, which I love. I love. And it goes with my shirt. That purple. Cool. Okay, okay, okay. Next, I do want to build up, make it more a bit shiny, huh? More, let's get the dark color. This time I will use the padding brush. We're going to use, I'm going to go with sink. We're going to go with the sink color right here next to it. I'm going to put that on top of the purple. Let's see how that comes out. Let's see if it comes out or not. Maybe a bit more. Oh, okay. You guys see that? 
Ooh, that is pretty. Oh, I'm getting like Ursula vibes now. Dang, that is pretty. That is pretty. Dang, you can actually see the colors. I am shook to the core. Okay. So now the top is pretty good. I'm just gonna um add the colors to the bottom. There you go. Kinda just blend that out. Blend that out. Okay. Eyes are done. Now I'm just gonna do my foundation off camera and be right back. Okay. So I did my liner and my face on that. Now it's time for the lipsticks. So excited. So the first one we're gonna do is Cruella. Cruella again is a bright um red red like the classic red lip. Here it goes. This is where I kinda mess up sometimes. I like second putting lipstick on. Here we go. Okay. Ooh, that is soft. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Okay, Cruella. I see you. I see you. Um, it's really soft. Really hanged. Okay. Boom. Okay. Cut on, cut on. Right here is where I always mess up on. Alright. Here's Cruella. Again. Classic lip. Classic red lip. Um, It's really soft. It's not sticky. Good job, color pop. Good job. I really like it. What do you guys think? Yeah, and the red lip. I like it. I like it. Okay. I'm actually digging this red lip. Honestly. Honestly. Digging it. I'm digging it. Okay, color pop. Digging. Alright. So, Cruella it is. Now, we're going to do Evil Queen. Okay, so we just did Cruella. Easy to come off, actually. I was so surprised. <laughs> so surprised. So now we're going to do Evil Queen, which is a more cranberry apple color. So, where's my mirror? <laughs> I'm like, oh, wait, wait, actually, we'll, we'll use the, yeah, we'll use, yeah. we we'll use my big mirror, because, here we go. Oh my gosh. A little bit, ooh, ooh, like right there. Here we go. Ooh. Okay. Okay, Evil Queen. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Ooh, okay. Okay. Wow. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Okay. You guys see that difference? Look, I have to down here, obviously. Me, get my makeup remover. Down here. Um, actually, this one is really good too. Oh my gosh. Okay. Here's Evil Queen. Evil Queen is more matte. Um, it has, it's a, it's not as soft as Cruella. Um, it is easy to put on. Um, will it last the entire day? I don't know. But, the only difference between the between Cruella and Evil Queen is that Evil Queen is more 
it's not creamy. It's more like a matte finish, and it dries up really fast. Okay, I see. <laughs> Um, but I, I could tell the difference because Cruella was really, really creamy compared to this one with a more matte finish. Overall of the collection, what was my review? Honestly, I like the colors on it. If you guys do, oh, I really like the colors. I really do. This palette was really nice. The only problem was the white. It wasn't that pigmented that I thought it would be. Um, overall, the other matte colors nicely nicely creamy really soft really easy to blend all the colors together um the lipsticks highly highly recommend if you guys want a matte finish a matte uh color i would recommend evil queen but if you do like like a reddish orangey tone cruella is the main one um do i recommend people getting this palette yeah yeah it's really cheap colourpop is a really good brand and if you guys like Disney, and this is the palette for you. If you're into the Disney villains, which I am. So that's why I got this palette. Do I regret it? No. Will I recommend it to people? Yeah. So get this palette. And yeah, that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys do, make sure you subscribe down below. Give this video a thumbs up for Disney makeup products to try out. Um... Let me know in the comments if I should do another look with this. Or let me know on social media like at Instagram or Twitter. I do want to play with more of the colors, especially like the greens and the blues. But today we just did the purple and it's nice. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I will see you guys very soon. Bye. <laughs>